Charlotte and Lewis picks on the internet, selling them for $250,000 each, MI5 and MI6 investigating. Harry is giving out security access information on purpose. Someone is trying to set him up as a puppet king. And the only way to stop this dastardly plot is to remove him and his children from the line of succession altogether. The royal family are onto this and are currently working hard to get Parliament to remove him and his family to thwart whatever plot these financial backers of Harry and Meghan have in store. By the way, the cryptic threat about William's children scares me the most, and I've not been more sure. See Harry, it's more sure, not surer, of this man's agenda and threat to the royal family in my entire life. Now a source says that Meghan actually posted sneaky photos of William and Kate's children on a secret society and sold them for 250000 each. At first, people thought that this was a joke. However, the name of the account selling photos is at Myra. This is considered Meghan Markle's hidden account. If this is true, Congress will certainly not stand still. Insiders say that since the release of Harry's book Spare and the end of the Sussex's Netflix reality show, MI5 and MI6 and William are trying their best to expose this terrible plot. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have been accused of taking a private photographer into Buckingham Palace without permission during their farewell tour of Britain after a behind-the-scenes image was broadcast to millions in the new Netflix trailer. The one-minute-long advert for the Duke and Duchess's new documentary shows a series of black-and-white photographs taken at the Frogmore Cottage, the wedding evening reception, as well as on holiday. One picture appears to have been taken inside Buckingham Palace, showing them walking out of the garden entrance. By convention, anyone wishing to film or shoot in the Queen's home requires permission, with strict protocol surrounding imagery in what is considered private quarters. The Telegraph understands the presence of the photograph was the subject of a written palace complaint at the time, as aides noted that the couple had not asked permission to shoot inside the Queen's home. The Sussexes aren't thought to have been made personally aware of the warning, Usually a memo would be sent to the Queen. It's fair to say that they were surprised to see there was a photographer, said one source, adding, under usual circumstances, you need permission to take pictures in that area. A second said, there's a very strict protocol about bringing a film crew or photographer. Usually a memo would be sent to the Queen in order to get approval. The photographer was not asked to leave, the Telegraph has confirmed. One insider said the appearance of a private photographer had been noticed by household staff at the time as the Sussexes came and went from the palace. It's certainly stretching the definition of privacy, said one critic after the trailer was released. For a couple who've been privacy obsessed, in 60 seconds they've shown raw emotion, private places, photos never before seen. They've blown their own protestations out of the water and detonated their own privacy policy. If I recall correctly, Meg said something along the lines of, we're only one plane crash from the crown, now Harry has taunted the soldiers, given information on how homes and the palaces are situated, causing a security risk for his family, 